The NAL is pushing ahead with its turnaround strategy to combat fraud, corruption and wastage. Parliament recently heard that the NAL Asia's liquidation was approved. The NAL Asia was a joint venture between the NAL and Gupta-linked VR Laser. Some of those matters where there is a case, we are developing um, criminal charges for that case so that we can attempt to recover some of those monies. The company has reported an operating loss of 1.9 billion rand for the past financial year. The now makes ammunition, missiles and armoured vehicles for South Africa and other customers in Africa, the Gulf and Europe. It received a 1.8 billion rand bailout from the government at the end of August after battling to pay salaries and suppliers. What the hell is this mean? Experts say the arms manufacturer can turn the tide by streamlining supply chains, reducing staff costs and exiting other businesses. What has happened in the motor industry at large in South Africa and of course the cotton industry more recently can be replicated in the defense industry in South Africa because we do have a comparative advantage. We have international best practice. The NEL says it expects about 30 billion rand in deals over the next two years as well as the largest export contract in its history. John Bailey, Pretoria.